The show must go on. My lord, as you wish. Uh, good old days until you know. The whole thing goes down with medieval. Ah, uh, you did not move. How sad. Bombs away! Bye, anti tank. Are almost dead. Wow, you survived. Duster unit, and I know Wayland's gonna be on it, but at least it's not fire since they're more powerful than, you know, Duster units. Over here, protect my three units. Capture the city. You are history. Alright. Which one? No, 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 no. He needs a level up. Dead. Hide here. Hey, man, what the hell? Man, go over here, man. Mac cheese. Right here. Just hide in the woods for more defense because of that battlecopter. I built myself a duster unit and a fire since I don't have enough buns. Unless I combine. You know what? Combine. Got more, more movement on a fighter unit. Oh, yes, I need one more unit. Big. And turn! Do your worst! Just delay then. Rain for your worst lesson of what you're about to teach me, and so far you didn't teach me anything. Ah, oh, Battlecopter, you are that eager to die. Okay! Oh man, uh, it's so sad to, you know, to see you be defeated, but might as well have someone, someone play a violin of your defeat. Capture the city. My city. My city now. Helicopter, you live long enough. Dead. Uh, no, not. Fire. Hey 
run a bit. You got him now. Defeat it! There's no way you can win now! You've lost! You've so lost! No, 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 no! I'm gonna check my fight target again! Shielding him. And another fighter unit. Are you brave to face it? Face the music, Raylan. And John. I'm surprised that tank unit survived. Yeah, I'm surprised. When I first played this, both of her tank ears are dead along with, along with her, both of her anti ears. And then one missile will survive at least. Okay, so far, battle units. Missile units. Okay. 
can. Himself, Lord Terror Douchebag of, of, of himself, Rayfield. How dare you disappoint him? Bomber units! Day 16, two more days of relief. Wow, I'm gonna do some chip damage! Hooray for chip damage! Doctor, it's so sad that you're gonna get shot down. But first, let's have a little CO power. We have to win! We have to survive! I'm not gonna end up like Shane Walsh! <laughs> uh, ready, cry! Yes, Bill, don't end up like a douchebag. That's not cool. One hundred percent sounds good to me! Bye, Rockets! I give you a do. Fighter, by at will, at my command. No, I'm losing, I'm losing. Yes, you are losing. I think you just lost your head. Sir. No! 
Iowa. Eat this, Tasha. I hope you attack that anti air. Oh my god. That's why I'm relying on your tank unit. Now this. Actually, I can do that. Now there's like in one shot. Which I can! Away! Bombs away! No! Take this! Winning! Winning! No! I don't like to lose! Tough luck, Raven! Eat this! Alright! No! Eat this! Kabang! Kaboom! Gun down, my good man! Fire! No! I surrender! Please have mercy on me! Uh, I don't believe in mercy, um, Mr. Raven. Chicken meat, my good man. No! No! I forgot my parachute again! Fuck! No! I just don't get it! I just don't get people like you, you know? The world's gone, brother man! Ain't nothing out there worth fighting for, you know? And yet here you are with your friends and your hope? I, I don't get it! I just don't get it! You gotta worry about you! Just like me! We all need our hope when we rebuild this world, me man! That's what you'll never understand, you hear? Be red! Yes! So long, Mr. Raven! You've been owned! 375 points, hooray! My power, great! It's time to take down Greyfield! Once and for all, folks! Day 17, not 18. Sadly, I lost one fucking unit. Medium tank. I salute you. Rest in peace. We got the wounded off the battlefield. Is everyone accounted for? Um, well? Where is it, Isabella? Over here, over there. There's someone in that building. Okay, let's check it out. Sorry, Isabella, but I just don't see anybody, you know? And I can't imagine anyone would be here during a battle. Good day to you, sir. Please don't mind me. I'm just conducting a little research. An experiment, if you please. Um, hi there? Ah, oh, well, it is so good. Very good to finally meet you at last, face to face. I believe you are the new commander of Banner's Wolves. Are you not? Congratulations! Are in order? Hmm? When the? How do you know that? Who are you? How the fuck you know my name? And why are you taking notes in the middle of the war? Hmm? My name is Dr. Coder. And as for my copious note taking, well, I am researching the effects of warfare on the human spirit, you know. You're doing what now? Ever since the mirrors, I have traveled this world observing and recording on this videotape right here. Those falling stars were a true boon for men of science like me myself. I have always wanted to observe men in a world reduced to utter chaos and destruction. How much I endure. In truth, I have never been so happy in my life. You're researching us? Really? I have been able to witness and document the true nature of humankind. I have watched people fight among themselves as their food supplies ran dry, you know, like in Russia. 
I have seen villagers panic at mere rumors of disease and fame. They're all starving, you know. I have observed it all, and I have finally fa I and now uh, and I have found it to be fascinating. You're disgusting. No, merely curious. At first, I allied myself with the Lazarian army, but now. I want to see how war would be conducted in a world without law. But that force I had a misplaced cavious spirit and was of no use to me whatsoever. I offered him all manner of terrible new weapons, but he denied me at every turn. No man such as he have always stood in the in the way of human progress. General Forsyth was a decent, honorable man, unlike you, prick! Quantities that I hope will no longer be respected in this wo new world of ours. At any rate, I had no use for him whatsoever, like I said. So I turned instead to one devo devoid of all mortality, Admiral Greyfield! He embraced my weapons. Even now, he prepares to use my masterpiece. I do love that man. You, you're evil. Eh? Dr. Morris once asked me if I believe in evil, in people who felt glad the world was destroyed. Well, well, Coder's not evil, not, not truly that evil compared to Serpent Kenji. You, you don't want to meet that guy. He's, ah, uh, yeah. He's like worse than Chagall. Now I know they exist. I'm looking at one. Oh, where, where I a more emotional man? I might be hurtful by such words. I have done nothing wrong, Will. Come on, might as well go over Serpent Kenji. You know you want to join a Serpent Clan. I am the very model of an objective scientific observer. Like all men of science, I have merely followed my heart and studied what interests me, you know? But I see you will never understand that. A pity, truly a pity. Wait! Oh, before I forget, I must recognize all the work, hard work my daughters have been putting in. Ah, uh, we are making steady progress. Do carry on. Isabella! What did you do to her? Bing! I suggest you speak to Ma to her instead of me. She doesn't have much time left, you know. You! Greyfield is on his way with my masterpiece in his hands. Whatever will happen. Hmm, I think I will need more notepads. Damn it, I really need some more notepads. Ah! Isabella, can you hear me? Are you okay? Yes, I'm so, so sorry, Will. I was so worried. That man, I've seen him before. Where? I don't know. I don't know where, who he is or where I met him. But I know him. He is a very, very fighting man. Good heavens! Dr. Coder is alive? Jesus Christ! You know him, Dr. Morris? I know of him, and more than I'd like. Cora is an infamous figure in the medical world. A mad genius despised by all his contemporaries. I'm, I'm, I'm fighting real. He was thrown out of the Mi M medical academy for conducting bizarre, unethical experience. A year later, he sustained terrible injuries in a suspicious plane crash. But this only embroiled him to continue his horrible research. I thought he was dead. This world is a much more dangerous place with him in it. Wait, are we talking about the same coder? The one in charge of IDS? IDS? You don't mean. IDS stands for Intelligence Defense Systems, Will. Before the mirrors, they were the world's largest military military contractor. They had connect connections at the highest levels of Rubinel government. With contracts in everything from weapons to medicine to food, the world 
between Rubinel and Lazuria was especially profitable for I for them. Why is nothing more than a common war profit to you, you know? Carter said he gave Greyfield all of his new weapons. And my god, I'm so terrified. He was happy too, like a kid with a new toy. He said he wanted to study the results when Greyfield used his masterpiece, wherever the fuck it is. Oh dear, I don't even want to know what that is, Will. Isabella, something tells me you know about this, no? His masterpiece, it must be the Cotomer's missile. That doesn't sound very good. Wow, it looks like a mushroom. Both, both nations possess enough missiles to destroy the other ten times over. Like a nuclear warhead? Cotomer's missiles were developed by IDS and located in Rubinel and Luzeria. They were designed to launch at the same time, all of, of them, in theory, they function as deteriorates, but now... Greyfield, you madman! You're gonna die for this! If those missiles launch, it's going to make the mirrors look like, like, fun terriers! Sorry, even I thought that was a bad joke. We have to stop him. Yes, Will. You can use a new seal, Raylan. Hooray! And we're facing off Chapter 21, Lin's Gambit. And of course, this is a last rushable map, which I'm gonna enjoy. This is Sentu 3 saying, Greyfield, you're next!